Hard stop. Food fetish review. I had actually ordered breakfast. <clears throat> waiting to, uh, waiting for a job in Monterey. Old Monterey Cafe. I think it says breakfast every time. That's the sign I keep seeing. Um, that's at 489 Alvarado Street in downtown Monterey. Now, this is like a $13 breakfast. Which is probably more than I'm going to typically spend on breakfast. And I'm sure, as good as it may be, uh, yeah, we'll see. What's my time looking like? I'm not looking at, okay, so, so, if this is a botched review, it's because the camera's turned around. I can't see the screen. I'm using this so I can use the wide angle. Hopefully capture more of the essence uh comes with a little bit of i think that's ketchup you may not be needing that no there's potatoes in here we do need that oh, okay i gotta show you this because i've had a peak salsa uh that looks like <coughs> that looks promising silverware salt and pepper i actually have salt and pepper Mama didn't raise no fool. First of all, everything in California so far has been in these sort of biodegradable, recycled carton paper. Does it always hold up so well with moisture? No. Simple fix for that. Foil. Line it with foil. But here's what we're looking at. Now, this was called a... Um, I should have told you at the beginning. Had a name. I told the gentleman what I wanted. It didn't sound like I was going to get a burrito. Uh, I don't know if you just dress it up as a burrito, but this is the, um, oh, come on, baby. Huevos Valdez, as they say in the old country. Um, uh, yeah, they were, all right, good about putting condiments in there. Appreciate that. Uh, cause you never know when you're going to want to salt it up. I don't know everything. Oh, this is like a chorizo burrito and it's got a, I love potatoes. The burrito is cut in half. And half of it has a dollop of whipped cream. Whipped cream. Sour cream. The other one has a dollop of uh, guacamole. So these are a little wet because they've kind of sat on themselves for a few minutes. But. Oh, I know I look like a mess right now. <laughs> I know I do. There's napkins in here. We're not going to worry about it. I'm trying to bite it so you can see a cross section of the food. Okay. Food reviews are not necessarily meant to be the most glamorous things, okay? Bear with me. My napkins rolled up with all my silverware, so. Windshield wiper style. <laughs> there you go. I don't know if you can see that. I don't know if you can see that, but there it is. Very good. It's chorizo. I'll be back. Probably not for this $13 burrito, but um, I would go there again. Yeah, sure. Sure. It's right in downtown. It's in all the haps. I'm sure that contributes to the price, uh, which I don't mind. Um, but you can probably do as good a burrito for less. Okay, that's like table salsa, you know, chips and dip kind of salsa. I'm not complaining. Um, it's good. Um, probably not homemade or batch made. Which, by the way, if anybody figures out the recipe for chachos, whatever the sal salsa roja is, please get with me. Uh, slide in those DMs and let your boy know. This was kind of a, um, not a rough morning, not even a rough start. Just a rough couple of passes. Uh, and my burrito was about to get cold, so I was like, you know what? We're going to stop and do this. We're going to break for a few minutes. Um, and then we'll start again. And that's what you got to do sometimes. So... 
whatever the name of this place is, which I've already forgot, Old Monterey Cafe. It's like a Tex-Mex place, but I'm sure they've got more than just Tex-Mex. I just wanted breakfast and I wanted something I could eat in the car. Got to eat this one in a box, but it is a good, good breakfast. Exactly what I needed, probably right on time. Very good. Um, probably have to go back and get a picture. I'm wondering now. Did we get a picture? No. Anyway. Thumbs up. Give them a try. Check out the menu. I bet they have a lot of really good stuff on there. Mm, I just kind of went with whatever the gentleman recommended to me out of desperation. But um, give them a shot. Tell them Nick sent you.